I know I'm going to be having fun because you, well. we have a certain Thursday designer here on yep. our Friday, <laughs> as well as our amazing stylist. We've got Lisa Rogers and Brian Gluckstein <laughs> joining me today. Nice. Hi there. Aren't you two just a perfect little couple looking there? I know, absolutely. We try. We try. I know. Now, I know, I know you feel very them. passionately about um, men's fit, whether it be casual or a little bit more sophisticated, yes. but today we want to spend some time talking about suits. Yes. Yeah. Suits for men, I have to tell you, even from the Grammys, the red carpet, I could not believe what I was seeing. The most imaginative, creative suits. Finally, men can have a little bit of fun, but it has to mm -hmm. fit properly. Oh, there's yeah. nothing worse than ill-fitting suits. Right. So even if a guy has a suit now that's a little big or it's a little older, take it and get it taken in. Yeah. yeah. So we'll show you with the suits we have how mm -hmm. You know, you can be slim, you can be a bigger guy, but yeah. it should fit. Yeah, it's got to fit, and that's the yeah. way it's always be been bad. for women, so why shouldn't it be also, the same for men? Also, every woman loves a guy in a suit. Absolutely. Yeah. I really do. I do you love a guy so in a suit, beautiful. just by yeah. any chance? Totally. <laughs> Me too. I'm a sucker for it. So Richard, so for Richard, Richard's a cool guy, and yeah. I wanted a suit yeah. that was yeah. a classic, handsome suit, but with a twist, so it's the color. Yes. So with Richard, this is the perfect color for him because it's not sort of the boring suit. So if right. a guy's got a little edge, a little creative, uh, a younger guy, go with color. Again, I love it. This, oh, is, this is not a, nice a crazy color. color, but it just look with his skin how fantastic it is. Mm -hmm. And then we use the pattern shirt. I love pattern shirts. Mm -hmm. Again, it makes it a little more relaxed. Yeah. And then just a solid tie. And then with this kind of color, we chose sort of this oh, ox blood my shoe. My favorite, I love that color. And that again, is beautiful. Keep the shoe, it's the same thing for women and men, I think. Keep the shoe simple. Look mm -hmm. how simple that shoe is. You can wear that with a jean. Jeans. You can wear that with a suit, but keep it simple. No. But Brian, couldn't you wear the jacket as well with a jean or put something, you Absolutely. know? Absolutely. And, and I don't, I, I mean, I'm a big thing about suit lengths. I don't like the super short no. jacket. I mean, no. it's not for me. It looks like Pee Wee or Herman. Or down to the knees. Yeah. No, no, down to the knees. So this is like, turn around, like this is where is it is. Just leg. below there. That double vent is nice too versus well, it's very that comfortable. single center vent, which sometimes I find gets messy looking up. Yeah, so no, you're right, Lisa. Neat. It can pop out. And, and a suit should always go in like this. I don't care how big you are, guys. It's got to go in. Yeah. Well, it's going to help you, actually, if you're big. Makes, Thank yeah. you. Yes. You look great. I you look that. cool, young, yeah. put together. Beautiful. Oh. So, so we, we brought Adam from Bay Street and we got him his, so he's got this beautiful Glenn oh. check suit. Again, it's this pop of color. Right. So the striped shirt and have fun. This is a way guys can wear the same suit often, but really change it up with the shirt and the tie. If he wears a blue shirt with his navy tie, it's going to look like a completely different suit. Right. Again, very tailored, and, and Richard's sort of uh, a guy. I mean, yeah. he's got a big body. He's a he's, man's man. He's a man's guy. But still, see the way this goes in? Yes. This gives you the, it's the same thing for women. Right? You want a waist. I don't care That's how right. big someone is. Absolutely. You want the waist. Talk to me a little bit about the, I know the lapels are getting narrower. I a little like narrower, that, right? A little narrower. So we're not going too, you don't want to go too extreme. You don't want to go too big or too small because it's going to go out of style right. and this is an investment Classic. when you're buying a suit so you want to go a mid-size this is a great size and a little pocket square but nothing of this is too exaggerated so you're you're not attracting too much to the clothes this right. is the type of thing when he leaves you just remember he looked handsome and, and he's an elegant guy yeah, I want to talk just about the pants here because uh, he does have a regular guy's leg but he's not wearing a pant that's overly baggy exactly yes. so if you if you're like a, a thin guy you can go with the slim fit if you're a yeah. hockey player guy you could you go a little baggy but not baggy not baggy so there's baggy. a little bit of movement here but yes. it's not out to here but that's it's still the worst thing narrow down around the ankle you and that got gives him that yeah, slimness slim, and long, again and pants should not break too much. They should just break. Yes. You, there's nothing worse. I go crazy when I see a man where there's like a foot of fabric at the bottom. You, <laughs> it's right. like an accordion. Do you run up to him? Do you run up to him? I don't want to embarrass him, but I'd like to get so some much. pins. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I knew it. I knew it. They just need a platform shoe to go along with the with the with the so material. So for Graydon, we have again the Glen Check nice. suit with a little bit of color with the burgundy, and yeah. then I got to straighten that out for you. <laughs> it must and be just so. And then we did a more casual tie. So this is more of a fabric yeah, knit tie. It's mm -hmm. not the silk tie. So if you want to go a little more 
cash with an elegant suit. You can go into these knit ties. Yeah. Again, a striped shirt. That uh, collar on that shirt is different too, Brian. Yes, it's a wider open collar. Yeah. Again, it's a little more casual. Okay. Yeah. So, uh, so when you are looking for a casual, a casual look, then it's it's in the fabric in the tie. In the fabric in the tie. It's in the collar of the shirt. It's not so stiff and like this is a more traditional collar. That's a little more sort of youthful collar. But this okay. really, really takes a classic suit and sort of. I've edges always it liked knit ties, and knit ties work again with jeans and a sport yes. jacket and that kind of thing. It is, so you but can it's mix got it up. texture, and exactly. I like that. Exactly, yeah. and then the the. Ox blood shoes yeah. again and lovely, which goes really nicely with the tie. And the, and the shoulder has to fit here. It yeah. doesn't come out to here, guys. If the shoulder is out here, it's too big. Yeah, yeah. it has to fit where your shoulder stops. Yeah. It's the butt is where the butt is, and the shoulder is where the shoulder is. <laughs> so that's how it works. Yeah. <laughs> Thank but you, you very know what? much. We could go great. into a big store like the Bay. They're gonna guide and they you. Have men on work in the suit department yeah and you okay. can get Let a proper just... fit it's really that's right it's, it's important to take your time don't you agree it is in a good fit from mm -hmm. somebody in the department okay oh, so richard richard one. just got off his yacht in the hamptons yes <laughs> yep so uh, he's got money y'all so here this guy's he is loaded. okay so if you're Look going to a casual wedding <laughs> this is great for a casual wedding yeah so if you're going to a summer wedding that's a little more casual i love the linen pants Again, the linen oh, jacket. Nice. It still has a classic cut. It still has that double vent on the yeah. back, which yeah. is really comfortable and classic. I love, this is very European, oh. to add that splash of color with the sweaters. You could put an orange sweater, a blue sweater. I just love See, that. In Europe, all the men have a sweater like that. It's like a man's scarf. Exactly. And it's always tied around. Absolutely. And my husband always looks and goes, what is that? Why is that thing on his back? How is right? he wearing it like that? What is that? Well, it just stays there. I wear this all the time. I wear, I wear sweaters you like wear this all the time. time. And last year, what happened? I said, we're going to your summer wedding. Brian, what do you think? Brian picked out this exact out. This is literally what Leo wore to Isn't the wedding. Yeah. Again, this and he got compliments all night. Yeah. It is the perfect thing it's for elegant a and relaxed. summer It's not sloppy. So when you're, and even a casual Friday. Yeah. yeah. You know, you could do this. And, but again, the shoes oh, are casual yeah. too. So we've the got shoes the, are great. the suede sort of running shoes. Very nice. But this is where if you're going to go somewhere casual, a wedding that's a little more relaxed, Beach a party wedding. that's a little more relaxed. Yeah. But you want to look like an elegant man, this is the that's look. Well, what now you the do. sweater on the shoulder, at what moment does that like happen? Like, do you take it off, wrap Never. it around your no, head? No, no, this is when it's party time. Woo! Yeah! Woo! Oh, it's the reception. The reception? No? No? Stop. Yeah, no, Stop. no. Stop. Sorry. Stop the craziness. My wedding, my party. Are fun. I don't Show know. Is out of control. She's such a bad influence on the boys. <laughs> Looking he went with it. it. <laughs> okay, so we're oh, gonna adjust. This, I love that jacket. Styling 101. Look at he's jumping yeah. up with yeah. every model. You do what you gotta okay. do. Okay. That's fine, Brian. Are they changing quickly back there? Okay, yeah, they so are. So this on is layers. a casual jacket. Oh. This is a, like a quilted. It's almost between yeah. a cardigan and a jacket. Yeah. So this again, casual Fridays, casual. Elegant evening out, going to a party. Look at this. This could be. This would be That's great beautiful. with jeans and a polo like underneath yes. it. But it's this quilted, relaxed, and it's very relaxed and moving. You're not sort of restricted. This one is hysterical. She's she's crying with laughter. <laughs> and then we've got that the cart. I love a zip cardigan yes. underneath. Yeah. Really? Do you really? You wouldn't know. We had no idea. We were almost wearing the same outfit. <laughs> I know. And then the gray pants. I love a gray pant. Now this is has that flannel look, but it's a summer weight. Yes. Okay. So you can still have that man's suiting fabric, but gray this is... Gray and navy are so beautiful together. I mean, a lot of people just think gray and black or gray, no. but I like the way you've done that beautiful navy, which I think is always really, really In gives style. warmth to any face. Mm -hmm. You've done the soft gray, but you've finished with the brown, beautiful well, that's suede what you have desert to do. boots. So you don't, I wouldn't do... Nice. If you wore a black shoe, don't oh, wear a black no. shoe with gray, because it could be a little heavy. You can yes. wear it with a suit, but this is a little more relaxed that suede, that sort of saddle color suede. Yeah. But again, I love the men's suiting fabric of the flannel, but in a summer weight wool. Very hey, nice. Uh, another question. Thank so you so much. So now you've got a gray pant. Yeah. And what's your sock? Is it matching the gray <laughs> pants or the shoe? It should match the pants. Is okay. there a sock under there? Because some there men are just not wearing them at all. Okay, sock. he's doing gray. gray Thanks, love. That was great. It's it's hard to find caramel socks. This okay. is a nice look too. So we're going yeah. very casual there. Very with casual. The, uh, so for Braden, we did a polo. So I want to show you how you could use a polo. Now you don't have to use a white polo. You could use a navy polo, a bright blue polo, an orange polo. Yeah. But this is with a more relaxed sweat. Um, uh, 
Um, jacket. Sports jacket. Coat. You think I know what that sports was? Jacket. Yeah, sports jacket. <laughs> sports jacket. So this has a little more texture. It has a little more casual feel. Right. Uh, we mix it with a, um, a more twill. like a woven twill, a twill pant. So yeah. it's a casual pant and a desert boot. Those are cool. Hold that yeah, for one I second. I like this those. This is a little too much, so it would be like that. I don't want people to think I like the way that was. Well, this is what you have to do, though. I mean, like that. you That's can get any suit as long as you get it tailored yeah. to your specifications. Exactly. Now, so you've got to get that stuff tailored. My dad was a lawyer, and he never wore his paw. His, he always had that in there, but it was always out softly a little bit. That, what, what are the rules on that? Oh, now like they're doing tailored. it very yeah. straight. You have to be like a real. Well, he was. Yeah, to be able to just he throw was, it in your pocket. Actually. Yeah. But have fun but with this. This again, Gabby. casual Friday. I love the coat. Yeah. And, very and, nice. And mix it up with a but fun color. But that would be great with jeans, right? Fabulous. That well, we had jeans in the back. He tried yeah. them on, but I decided yeah. this at the no, last. No, it looks minute. very. We've got more of their amazing advice coming up later on Fashion Friday. Stay with us. They got a lot to say.